Finally tonight, choosing family over fame, John Berman introduces us to an exceptional athlete and son. For nearly every kid who steps on a football field, this is his dream, to play in the NFL. Keith Fitzhugh was one of those kids. I always wanted to play football. That's all I thought about, eat, sleep, football. After college, he did get a small taste of that dream, playing on the New York Jets practice squad, before being cut this fall. He landed a job as a train conductor for Norfolk Southern Railroad outside Atlanta. I love ride on chains. That's always been a backup plan for me. But then something remarkable happened. Yesterday, the Jets called and asked him to come back and join the team. His answer, even more remarkable. I had to turn him down because I had a, uh, a great job. The conductor said no. No to pro football, no to a near certain trip to the playoffs. People say, hey, they might have a chance to play in the Super Bowl. And I sit back and think, and I tell them, hey, you only got one mom and dad. <laughs> one mom and dad that he lives with in Georgia. His father is disabled and can't work. His parents depend on his salary as a conductor to make ends meet. He would have made more for the Jets, but there is no guarantee it would last. I could have been released again. It's about being a young man and not being selfish. I just appreciate him, you know, loving us that much to say, I'm going to stay home with mom and dad and I'm going to help them. Today, even the Jets say his decision showed character. Well, that's one of the reasons why we wanted that kid. Keith Fitzhugh is passing up one dream for another. He's a great kid. He really is. He might never be a great player, but he is already a great son. John Berman, ABC News, New York.